Hello and thanks for tuning in. My name is Tony. I'm the product manager for the Avidus Ilgen Company. And today we want to show you a fabulous new family of symbols called the S family. It's a project that spanned in the R&D phase for over two years. Uh, we didn't have all the technology when we first started, but uh, what you're seeing today is the result of some fine symbol craftsmanship. And I want to tell you a little bit about the alloy composition, and that's an 88% copper, 12% tin, which really gives you a balanced fundamental response and frequency uh, between the lows, mids, and highs. So B8, we know, is a very focused uh, sound, and B12 is really right in the middle, and then B20 is a, a lower pitch naturally. When you add tin content into a cymbal, it lowers the fundamental pitch. So the S is great in that it gives you a little bit of everything. These cymbals are fully lathed on top and bottom, and you can see that's apparent when just looking at them, how they're very beautifully lined. And you can also see that they're extensively hammered, most apparent by looking at the underside of each cymbal, which really gives these a dialed in sonic response and weight, feel, and most importantly, sound. Here in front of us, we have four different models, which is a small representation of the full lineup of this family of symbols. There's actually 33 unique models and two symbol sets, which are comprised of some of the most popular uh, individual symbols. So they're all 18 inch diameter and they're basically in different weights. So this is the thin crash, medium thin crash, rock crash, and new and special to the S line is the trash crash, which um, has two different size holes within many parts of the symbol to create that distortion boost. So first I'll play the 18 inch thin crash. So the thin crash is going to be great for even lower volume to medium volume settings uh, where you need a cymbal to speak very quickly. Um, it's a beautiful shimmery sound. It's the thinnest weight out of the S family. Next we'll have the medium thin crash. So you could probably hear with this one you get a little bit more body a little bit more sustain since it's in that really middle of the weight class. Uh, so this is going to be the best choice for if you need a general crash to work in a number of different volume settings and environments. You can really never go wrong with a medium thin crash. It's going to give you uh, the mix of everything. Next in line we have the rock crash, which is a medium heavy weight. So as you can hear, more volume, uh, more projection, these symbols uh, need no introduction as to uh, what they're capable, capable of, what surrounding they should uh, find themselves in. Perfect for rock gigs when you're really competing as a drummer with all those amplifiers next to you. This is going to open up uh, and sing better with ease versus something like a thin crash if you're using that uh, in, in different settings. Next is the trash crash. So you can see the difference between the thin crash and the trash crash. The trash crash uses that thin symbol with just these perforations and that just creates that big distortion boost, that really unique trashy sound that's going to cut because of those higher frequencies. So to summarize the crashes we just went over, I'm going to hit them each from left to right just so you can get an idea of how they differ from each other. So again, these are just four out of 33 unique models, which hopefully give you a better idea of where to start perhaps looking um, for your new S family symbol. And we want you to go down to your local Zildjian dealer and try them out for yourself. Thanks for watching.